While it might be week three of high school football around the state of Montana, it's the opening week for the Class AA schools. Out here at Missoula County Public Stadium, the Sentinel Spartans, with all of their high expectations, opened the season and welcomed the Flathead Braves. Didn't take long for Sentinel to start hot in this one. Washington transfer Camden Sermon started things quickly with this score on the scramble to make it 7-0 Sentinel early. Through the air now, Sermon looks to his left, finds Hayden Cruz on the screen, and now it's 14-0 Spartans. Camden Dernberger drills the 26-yard field goal, making it 17-0 Sentinel as their offense continues to roll. Sentinel rotated quarterbacks in their opener, and last year's starter Dayton Bay finds Joe Wida on the 6-yard touchdown as Sentinel takes a 24-0 lead. Sentinel still rolling here, and Sermon doesn't let up as he airs out a beautiful pass to Frenchtown transfer Jace Klusiewicz on a transfer-to-transfer -transfer connection, who makes it 30 to nothing in the second quarter. Flathead, though, finds some life late in the second as Charlie Hinchy rolls out to his left and hits Nicholas Gustafson, who avoids the defender, to get the Braves on the board. But on the very next play, Sentinel halts that flathead momentum in its sermon again. He keeps it, goes up the left sideline, and it's a house call. 75 yards as Sentinel takes a 45-7 lead into the half. The Spartans would tack on a pair of touchdowns in the third quarter, and Flathead would also add a pair of second-half touchdowns, but the Spartans end up being too much in this one as they live up to the hype in the Class AA opener and go on to defeat the Braves 59-19. to Yeah, I think it was, uh, the environment was different, and so I was uh, super pleased with our aggression early, defensively and offensively, and you know, just, just jumped on them early, and then the second half we wanted to be physical, and so everything we're asking these kids to do, they're doing, and, uh, it's always going to be about team football, and as you see, we have a lot of weapons, a lot of guys that care about um, just just winning ball games, and it's, it's fun to coach them. You know, we gave them some short fields early on. Fentanyl's a great team, and we got to play perfect to beat a team like that. We're little, we're little green. You know, I was really happy with how we finished the football game, though. Our kids never quit. You know, when you're down 44 nothing or 44-7 or whatever it is that at half, it's easy to go full, full of the tents and go home. But, man, we came out and battled the last 24 minutes. I, I was really proud of our kids. You know, scored 14 points. We moved the ball well offensively. Um, we just got to get back to doing the basics, and I think we'll be all right. Yeah, it, it's been a long buildup. And I said it all week that the main thing was kids having fun, and there's a lot of different ways to define fun. And fun for us is competing. Uh, playing the game of football, but for about two and a half hours, we forgot about kind of all the things we've dealt with in the last six months, and we'll continue to push forward and get better. Sentinel racked up 470 yards total while holding the Braves just 171. Sermon ended up finishing with 146 yards on the ground, and Soren Sieverd added 82 and a pair of touchdowns as well. Sentinel will take on Helena Capital next week, while Flathead will battle the Missoula Hellgate Knights. In Missoula, Kyle Hansen, MTN Sports.